There is a, a melee table. We thank you for bringing him safely here. We also ask you, Lord, for a successful and hurrying occasion. Dignifying. Let this occasion be a blessing to Dansoman and the whole nation. Father, we seize this opportunity to ask for peace. Peace before election and peace after election. We also pray for a good choice of the leaders of this nation for growth and for progress. Father in heaven, we thank you and we also ask you that whatever is be behind this flag, whatever is being unveiled today, be an inspiration to every person that passed by this runabout. We thank you for a successful celebration and occasion and whatever, whatever. We thank you in Jesus' name. We also ask blessing, wisdom, good health for our dear president, Nana Adodankwa Akufuadu. Let him be blessed for all generations to come to hear his name. In the name of the Father, in the name of the Son and of the Spirit, shall all children of God say amen. amen. Thank you very much, the very reverend. We're grateful for this opening prayer. And may I remind all of us here present thank you very much let the vuvuzelas go down for us this is a solemn occasion we are remembering and honoring the memory 10 years on of the gallant female politician who is one of the pioneers of our party in this part of the region. She was the first ever parliamentary candidate and member of parliament, should I say, member of parliament for the Ablekuma South constituency when it used to be Ablekuma South and Ablekuma West together. Indeed, took the baton as parliamentary candidate from Ni Dakucho Ochi who then on became the mayor of the city of Accra and now a member of the Council of State. But she became the foremost member of parliament for this constituency in the Fourth Republic. So this is a gallant politician and a gallant woman of the soil that were here to honor her memory. She's, she was actually the first ever national woman organizer of the new patriotic party as well. That is the reason why all party members are here, clad in party colors, to honor the memory of this great woman 10 years on. May I now introduce to you the various traditional rulers and dignitaries here present here for this solemn occasion at the Dansoman Roundabout. Here with us, representing Ni Adote Otinto Sempe Manche, is Ni Adote Mampong II, who is the Mampong Se Manche who happens to be the father of the Sempe Manche. Then also, we have Ni Adote Famlinte, the first, who is Shiabu Manche. You can clap for them, please. We also have Ni Adote Kasa, the first, Niji Opetekwe Manche. We have Ni Adote Obedeka, Obedeka, the second, Mpwase Mankralo. We have Ni Sen Noche, Niji Mpwase Senche. We also have Asafwache Ajo, Shiabu Asafwache. Then we have Asafwanye, Nyomawaku, Mpwase Asafwanye. 
Keke oye na adole owa man ni ji Kenklemo ni ji Russia manye. We have Ochami ni moi the first. Ochami ni moi the first. Ni ji opete kwe Ochami. Ochami make Ochami. Keke oye Ochami tete owusu ni ji mamponse Ochami. Eka waya ni atofo, ni ji enyono, le ji shabu atofo che. Eka waya asafo ache, omani mensa, ni ji upete kwe asafo ache. Eka dromo na, we have nana chum berima sanahini of achim akukum. Also here to support in this solemn ceremony. Then up on the days, may I then introduce to you, the first ever parliamentary candidate for Ablekuma South and Ablekuma West combined. And the one who lifted up the hands of the woman we are about to celebrate here today, Honorable Teresa Na Ameletego. And also then on became the mayor of the city of Accra and now a member of the Council of States, Honorable Stanley Ni Aji Blankson. Next to him is the Minister for Trade. Honorable Alan Kojo Chamanting. Next to him is the Foreign Affairs Minister, Minister for Foreign Affairs and Regional Integration, and also the Member of Parliament for Anya Sotuom Constituency, one of the longest serving members of Parliament in Ghana's Parliament, in Ghana's Fourth Republic. Her name is Honorable Shelley Na Ayoko Bochi. Moving on to the right of His Excellency, we have the Regional Minister for the Greater Accra Region, Honorable Ishmael Ni Ashite. And next to him, we have the Member of Parliament for Etiwa West Constituency, and also the Minister for Roads and Highways, the prolific minister, Honorable Kwesi Amwakun Atta. Next to him, we have the regional chairman for the Greater Accra Region, Honorable Divine Otu Agohom. Next, we have the Deputy Regional Minister, Honorable Elizabeth Kwacho Saki. Then the Deputy Chief of Staff, Honorable Asensu Bwachi. We also have here the parliamentary candidate for Able Kuma South, incoming Honorable Bernard Ni Anya Brown. And ladies and gentlemen, your own, the Member of Parliament and Parliamentary Candidate for Ablekuma West Constituency, Honorable Esla Owusu Ekufu. Ladies and gentlemen, Aka Nyefe Nefe, Aka Nefe, Aka Efe Cho, Eka Free SHS and Namimba, Eka Napko and Namimba. A can plant for food and jobs, a Namlimba. A can one district, one factory, a Namlimba. One village, one dam, a Namlimba. One million dollars per constituency. Ladies and gentlemen, the President of the Republic of Ghana, Nana Adodankwa Akufu. Thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen. We are glad and honored to receive His Excellency the President here at Dansoman in Ablokuma West. Without much ado, shall I invite the regional minister, Honorable Ishmael Ashite, to give us the welcome address for this occasion. Wo hie nyelo niji wo president Nana Adu Dankwa Akufu Adu. Wa ministers fani eba question ye be levi na party unupa ni eba question ye be levi na wa member of parliament ni le no ji wa parliamentary candidate ni le nye wa hie ye be Neji wo sister Esla Owusu Ekufo. Ni me kename. Ni eba kweji ebi ele ebi ne. Pati bi fe. Ni eba bi ele ebi ne. Ke wo nye me. Ni je 
wo wolu ma he ni ji wo press house se ni e ba bi e le bi ne le bi ne wo ba pe si e bi e ni mo ni he wo ni wo ba pe si e bi e wo ni en yo ni echun e hise honabo teliza amele tego fi ma ke be ni wo wo je politics en se ameji onupa eni yen wo hin wo da be ke be e wo chi o wo bankole leji wo party e first national women organizer ye parliament le hun ne ba e bo modern ake e ba bu awona ni e ka wa tu ni e ji yo ko ni hin wa wa di enche lo bi ami e fi o mi ake consistency ne ye ble mami e je wono ni si e bo modern ne mi hin ahun ni e he consistency e ma ji ni e ke ma shi e sa e twa le e ma shi ojo gba hun ni no mi wo yen mene awon bi ane wo yen mi yo esla usu e ba mo mi ni lehun e chu he ni ojo gba hun e fe o mi ake e fe ne ni e ka wo wo yen mi yo na amelete go hien nyam ndo mo ene no ni me ka na me ka ngle nye fe ka mba ni nu wo fe o le bi ne Wanye mi yo, amele tego. Wana esuno ni ashole amashi. Ni ehan wakaibu. Dag biye, ke waba chon biye, waba akaye ake yoko ba inshi. Ni echuni ojoba angu. Ke ehan akucho ne, ke ehan gana bi, nwe wo, wo president, then che efen and the kebab ye any ha was she woo a ke a genia boko ni wo MPP be one gen no he a ke one yemi Teresa Leleng a batuni bonisa ni a wa party boni a banya wo mene me koko me ba mummy ni ji wonye mi esla wusu le hun e chanu koni ene akaiwo da gbo kegbe ena ni wo fe wo bo modern ni wo he ni wo yo wo chu ni ojuban ni wo ke wa wo mangana koni wo se ku e wo hun akaiwo ene he wo nye fe wo nye ke nye ba ke ni rekome won hele nya ke ni jeyo ke mba ni fe mo ne twa no ma ni abrawo piao that was the regional minister for greater accra region we are grateful honorable so quickly we shall invite a representation of the children of the late honorable whom we are here to celebrate in the presence of kofi tego mokumbi son of Honorable Teresa Amele Tego. His Excellency, the President of Ghana, Nana Adodankwa, Aku for order. Our dear honorable Esla Osu Ekufu, MP of Lekuma West constituency, Minister of Communications. Our honorable is now Ashite, Greater Accra Regional Minister. Our honorable Stanley Adrie Blankson, Member of Council of State. Honorable Ministers, Honorable George Bray, District Chief Executive. Honorable State Interest and Governance Authority Representatives, Constituency and Party Executives, Nime, Name, Nananum, ladies and gentlemen. 
what began as a whisper 10 years ago has continued to resonate with me, and today we are all here to bear witness of it. It is an immense responsibility for me to speak on this day at a ceremony marking the 10th anniversary of my mother, late Honorable Teresa Amelitego, a great icon. For a day like this, it needs to be said that the next few minutes cannot capture completely the life and work and body of effort my mom put together during her beautiful and fruitful 68 years on this earth. Growing up, I had a peculiar experience shared by just a few. A mother who was a mother for all, shared by all along with my brother. We all so had the attention of the world and with it required a lot of discipline and focus to be able to live upright in the shadows of a wonderful mother God has blessed us with. A tough disciplinarian who expressed lots of love. She showed love, she, she loved her children fiercely while the world sought her attention. She never denied us her care, zeal, and compassion. Right from a young age, she imbibed in us a strong sense of community and to shine brightly wherever we are placed, just like her alma mater, a big girl's motto, Bipo Sohan, where she served as school prophet. Her love for children was not only our preserve, but also one that was expressed and shared gloriously among many other children we encountered. Her commitment to the development of the girl child was especially unique as she invested in the girl secretarial school that included French studies in this curriculum, as well as setting up charity programs, including one to help orphan street girls learn productive traits and, or, and a microcredit loan program for women. Her unrivaled devotion to the Ghana project during and after the return to democratic rule in the Fourth Republic was finally reflected in her work for the New Patriotic Party, where as one of the founding members and a great pillar in the establishment of the party, she also established the women's wing and served as the first national women's organizer. Mother's work has inspired a lot of academic and moral material for a generation of women after her and in the future. As a woman who handled ministerial duties in Greater Accra, Lantern Forestry, Works and Housing, and more sentimentally as a member of parliament who excelled among men and gave no excuses. A foremost feminist and believer in the empowerment of women, she is still to date a symbol of hope and prospects for the girl child. Many, not only in the, few, in the new protective party and her constituency, but Ghana at large, will look at her, up at her as a political philanthropic and a national icon who served her country and never asked for anything in return. For my brother and myself, this moment is rather a reflective and somber moment for us. While we would give anything to have mother by our side today, her sons are ever proud of the legacy she left, which continues to impact her in her death. The MPP, the values we carry, and all of us are part of the life work she committed to. In the sublime and soothing words of, the, of President Akufado, we are poorer for her loss. I can continue to assure each and every one of us all, all that through your support, love, and dedication to this great woman, the foundation and all of us will work hard to continue to keep her legacy alive. Thank you very much, and God bless you all. Adoman Kumachi Ami, a body as Shasiano or bad dear Mao, I mean Sam Munyan Kunsen, Sam, you know, my answer as soon. Me echo Nanawa, Miss Ramekas. I go, Ye Jimmy, I mean, my Jimmy, I mean, dear, no mamma me crying, Sam, me, Menkasa, me free chebby. Me dinde o bang kroma. Mari se mi ya mi beke. Matu ni din se. O ba pa amele tegu. Ye kai wu ma wa wumo o piafu. A e ye evangelist aferi o safu. A e ne o ye o chiyami. Ne tinti ma me se me. Mi mbe di hon chiyami. Mi jina o man gana yina ne mu. Ma o titu pesie. Nana do down kwa e kufuadu. Ni na be mu penny fuyina. A kwaba. Ni inyuma pa. Mede as 
sedasun kokoma asla owusu ono na oye imprem prem ra shebedeni wo abrekuma anafo ne mpeso asu na oba pa ameletegu baye osuafo a odikan sebe mejina mwanim a na enya me mpre wasem inti ne mum abofra onim ne nsa wo hro na ne impenim foto nsa didie baye infidu nie ya wada bi baye daboni bridge ye from a a ano ya den be bofa o mind gana na enye adewa oba pa onu onyamfo ameletego di ni juma pase osuafo a ohye emma ne mofra mofra ju medie so ba ne wie ye ye ya no osinya no die na ano ya den na ato abese wie pe eni ba hye pe asubetie na pe esibere abese nyu no ya no osinya no die na ano ya den pe eni ba hye pe asubetie na pe esibere abese nyu no ble kuma anafo ma shebejeni awudi kan wodi wonkoko ne wonkaka guwo wodi weni chira mrikisi ayansanemba adentia ohuli kete kenkenya me a ohuli ba foma anaba ohuli kwaso aneko ohuli wo kwaso a wansanamba biu adentia opusu nyeke wona wo pusu embra shebeje ma omo se won ka ma omo hu won ju ma pa ye ya no ne ba ni senye ya na isembe ye in krabia ne shebre shebre so ne krabia de ye mo no adane ye ana mo tintin bia ra so kopie krotia na wuti chaso a na ye saman po onu onya futi ti wa be ye wa afemu de sada achi inchima po odinya wade be hua hua won hu ene npp amanu ko no rekai mu juma pa ya mawo amo opiafo de mi fa dio die die ni amanu hu ye ya no se ene ya reka oba pa ameletego ho asema na ye di ne ka esanse osama pa na ye kai ne to no abedin Essence osama empa na ye kai no to no abedi Essence osama empa bia na ye kai no to no abedi Atsofokasia e true e mama na mo from of fry in course also na osan ba ye oso akwa be di ehira ohye injuma ne adanse eso tetre na proina na fiati asefo se oni pati ase na onya owua ne sama inyo na se oye ni papa owua ne sama be ye sama pa atuma kuma chi ame mebua na ye ni mse etikan fu je bi dankwa muda su di ma mpp amanyoku onu enkrato ye de ma wo oba pa ameletego se fa kwane se osunu kokoko party ne aye akondo akondo ni enike enika o mampeni na na do dankwa ekufu adu nim abebu na alaji ba wo mi asu nim asechre e ba ni sa popo bribri che amanuku a akan ama o my god na yina aji atum se for more years for nana ji ya no and from one in from a body or town for never to say by fire by thunder by fire by thunder and from one in from a body or town for never to say by fire by thunder abapa ameletego for in fiano kase koma abapa gladis asma abapa hawa ya kubi ne oba pa grace call man one hour when i want baby ko na say ya do man fo a ya na ya kai ya no ya no se kwasi ada be ya da na free me me dada pa se ebusu a pani wea bro na so be ma wa wo dia shenedidie mu ha ha ham ama 
now so on my penin and now do down quite a good father, dear, or be my own. what say in put to do my manasu or be us on my penin and now do down quite a good father, dear, or be my own. Auntie, what say in put to do my manasu or be us? What say I now? May say, Auntie, Nana do down quite a good father, dear. Mesdames, et vous. Nous avons eu un O kasa fwe, mumon se, mumon se, mumon se manu. O kasa fwe, ni di ni oba unkuma. Oba unkuma, oba unkuma. Na misha oba unkuma. Ni in samra, ni ni abodi ya. Udi abo His Excellency the President. Eni ya member of parliament, Honorable Esla Owusu Kufu. Eni ya ya mame, Honorable Teresa Amele Tego. Mambi, mambi ni ne ekwe shi. Yo eni... We are talking about the first member of parliament for Ablekuma South constituency when it was then together as Ablekuma South and Ablekuma West. Lenore Lehue, she was the deputy minister for works and housing. She was also the deputy regional minister for Greater Accra region. When she became the deputy minister for lands and forestry. Your Excellency, she also served as the Council of State member for the whole nation and also served as a lifelong member of the Council of Women's World Leaders. She owned a secretariat school here in Ablukuma South. This is the gallant national figure that we're here to celebrate. She was one of the foundation builders of this largest estate as well in the whole West Africa called Dansoman. So we are here to celebrate a woman in a just cause and give honor where honor is due. At this juncture, shall we all with a round of applause welcome the member of parliament and parliamentary candidate for the Ablekuma West constituency, your own, Honorable Esla Owusu Ekufu. Your Excellency, President of the Republic of Ghana, Nanado Dankwe Kufuadu. The Honorable Regional Minister, Ministers of State, Member of the Council of State, Distinguished Ladies and Gentlemen, Ablekuma West. Kable kuma wet south be mimbanye do manye. Teresa Namele Tego. He wa wa yo be mene. Ni nonin ka yo wa ye heji. E chemi ake ni le eshi se no imba nimba chunu chumo. Ninke la ken fe eja ke bie. I'm a son of Wacho, Neke Ubafi. She invited me on her sick bed and told me that, having left the seat at Blikuma South, I should get ready to start working to take over her place. And I said, It's a difficult constituency, so I wasn't going to do it. And she said, You will do it. You're the only one who can do it. And I'm handing it over to you to build on the foundation that I have laid and let the name of the MPP be immortalized here and plant the red, white, and blue colors here forever. And by the grace of God today, after a brief stint when this constituency was occupied by the NDC, it's back home 
and it will stay where it belongs. She's fondly remembered by people even today, 10 years after she passed on. Just last week, I met with fishmongers and fish sellers, and they said, You're continuing the good work that Amele Tego started, and we thank you. They say, Amele Tego, Ho Amoko Jimmy. So we're continuing with the good work. Her memory lives on. She's blazed a trail for generations of female politicians to follow. Despite the odds, and let the whole world know that without women as partners in development, no nation can develop. We're proud of her legacy. We're proud of the work that she did here. We're proud of the work that she did in government and we're proud of the work that she did for the new patriotic party. We will never forget you, Naomi Tegu. And it seems like only yesterday when she left us, but it's been 10 years already. 10 years from now, thanks to the name, the, what we're going to do here today, and the statue that is going to be unveiled here today, generations yet unborn would also know of the work that she came to do for the governance of this country and the development of the constituency. May her soul continue to rest in the bosom of the Almighty. Thank you. Thank you very much, Honorable Esla Awusio Kufu. And the torch that Honorable Na Ameletego lit will continually flame on. At this juncture, is the Koya command around. Another son of the soil of Dansoman carrying the torch and taking a Dansoman to Ghana and to the world. Ladies and gentlemen, let's invite the prolific musician Samini. And that was Samini doing the number one for His Excellency, the President of the Republic of Ghana, President Ehale Poza. Ago, ago, ago. Samini. <laughs> Samini. <laughs> Man like Samini in the house. Thank you very much. Oh, put your hands together. Put your hands together. <laughs> wow. Let it go up. 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 Thank you very much, Mr. DJ. Mr. DJ Radon. Mr. DJ Radon. You are not a young man, my young yellow and beba. You she doesn't have a you are a makanya sanuko. Eh, in boss, Lord Oblita Comedo, myself, me to Nicolac Basanuko. 
But you are Bacon, where no mere archer ball. San and Fay, I come away, Fay. Nibol and not try, keep up. Great job, Crown Regional Minister. <laughs> Member of the Council of State. Minister for Communications and Member of Parliament for Ablikuma West constituency. Dignitaries of the MPP government and state. District Chief Executive, Ni Adute Mampo, the second. Ni Adute Famlite, Ni Adute Kasa, Ni Adute Obedeka, the second. Na Owama, Na Osamanye. We recognize the family of the late Honorable Teresa Amele Tego, Kofi Tego Mukumbi and Kwame Tego Akwe, and her brother, the captain retired of Dear Tuo Kankam Bimpong. Residents of Dansumai, fellow Ghanaians, ladies and gentlemen. We are met here today on a sad but joyous occasion. Sad because we've come to remind ourselves of the passage of a, a colleague who was a valiant member of our struggle for freedom and democracy in Ghana. Emily Tego was a politician and of the first rank. She founded the women's wing of the MPP. And she was a vibrant member of the New Patriotic Party right until her untimely death. She served President Kufour's government with zeal and enthusiasm. And it's all that that we remember. Remember a woman who was determined to break through the ceiling and the glass barrier and make it clear that women had as strong a contribution to make to the public life of our country as any man. But it is also a happy occasion because we're being, we're being reminded by the ceremony of today that if you live a life of contribution a life of participation, a life of assistance to your community, your community will not forget you. And I'm very happy that this woman that I've known since I was a young boy, we met at the University of Ghana a very, very long time ago. She helped me with one or two women friends of hers when we were at Legon. So she always had a soft spot in my heart. 
But I'm so happy that I've lived to see this monument to her memory and to her sacrifice and to her work. A shining example of what is possible for each and every one of us if we stay, we stay true to our beliefs and we make the contribution that the good Lord has given us our portion. I'm happy to hear the sentiments of her son. Of a son who recognizes the quality of her an exceptional mother. All I can say is that today means that Theresa Amelitego, we will never ever forget her. And this monument stands as testimony to the work that she has done for our community, for our party, and above all, for our country. May she rest in perfect peace. In the bosom of the Almighty. Until the last day of the resurrection when we shall all meet again. Amen. Thank you. Thank you very much, Your Excellency, President of the Republic of Ghana. At this juncture, we shall call upon... The Municipal Chief Executive of the Ablikuma West Municipal Assembly, Honorable George Silbray, to do... The Member of Parliament, Ed Kofi, would move to the centre of the roundabout to Francis. unveil the plaque. The young ones in the area are also saying you've given them free education and they are indeed grateful. Our market women are saying your COVID relief funds has indeed come at a good time and they are grateful. Our police are also saying thank you very much because we've given them some fat salary increments. The party folks are saying you have shown true leadership and they are indeed grateful. But we all want to put this together and say, His Excellency, your biggest thanks is going to come in on the 7th of December 2020, where we are assuring you we will vote boom, boom, boom for you. Thank you very much and God bless us all. Thank you very much. So before we take the closing prayer, as part of the program, His Excellency the President with the Member of Parliament for Blackmore West and Kofi, son of the late Honorable Teresa Ameletego, will move to the plaque and they will unveil the plaque, after which we will say the closing prayer and take the Ghana National Anthem. Just as I mentioned, we shall receive His Excellency the President, the Member of Parliament and Parliamentary Candidate, and Kofi, son of the late Honorable Theresa Amelitegu. The three of them will move into the center of the roundabout and unveil the plaque for the gallant nationalist. Well advised, shall we invite the very Reverend, Reverend Sarah Amankwa Redu, presiding minister for the Ebenezer Methodist Church, Dantzoman, to do the closing prayer before we unveil the plaque and take the Ghana National Anthem. Shall we again give honor to God and stand up humbly and sing the Methodist hymn 313 to God be the glory great things 
he has done. One, two, to God. So love him. Oh, your daddy's life and successful occasion we thank, we thank you for many speeches we thank you for the life well lived by our mother Teresa Amelie Tego and I also pray that the whole Ghana women that passed by this way to look at this and be encouraged and moved by her ashes and live by it. We also thank you for the life of our head of state and all the parliamentarians. In advance, we thank you for a successful election and a good choice. And when everything is perfectly done. Lord God, we shall remember we did nothing. You have done all. We thank you for return journey to various destinations. We thank you in the name of Jesus. Shall we all say amen? His Excellency the President and the two sons of Honorable Theresa Ameletego will join the Member of Parliament and His Excellency the President to unveil the plaque for Honorable Theresa Na Ameletego. Right here in the center of the Downtown Roundabout. We are celebrating a lifelong council of state member of the Republic of Ghana, former Works and Housing Minister, former Member of Parliament, former Deputy Greater Accra Regional Minister, and the former Minister for Lands and Forestry. A lifelong council of state member, I mentioned, she is the loving mother. We're here to celebrate 10 years on after her passing. Put your hands together now as His Excellency the President pays homage to the memory of 
ORANG TUH